Are they still warm? Yes. My <laughs> six languages. Leo, let's hope that nothing will break. Look who knows how to open the doors already. Mm. Are you gonna let me read my book, please? Mister? Go. Uh. So, as I was saying... Do you mind? Let me show you what the hell he's doing. Leo. No. No. Leo. Leo, arrête. Arrête. Pas bien. Pas bien. Non, Leo. Non, arrête. Il faut arrêter là. Leo. I like to start the day by reading a book. Yesterday I started reading this book in English, Sapiens, A Brief History of Humankind. As you may have read in my description, I speak six languages, Dutch, French, English, Bulgarian, Russian and Portuguese. And uh, in order to maintain all of these languages, I, I try to read books in each of them. For example, in Dutch, I bought this um, book, The Pet Cemetery, and I'm reading that one. So, 
earlier this morning, Leo was guided by his spirit guides to chew on something. Let me show. So this is Philippe's thing for uh, the mate. And this. Voila. This is Leo's job. Okay, I'm not making this up. Look at him. And look what he brought. This is from the bathroom. I don't know why, but he loves it. So I, think I just should stop doing this. That's my breakfast for today, uh, one tomato, two eggs and two egg whites, I added salt, paprika and uh, another spice. I don't know how this is called in English, I will find it on the uh, internet and I will place it somewhere. I added Bulgarian white cheese, Bulgarians love bread, I am no exception. So let me add only one slice. I'm very careful with what I put on my plate because uh, I'm currently trying to cut back on, uh, on calories and to do 45 minutes of a spinning bike every day and combine this with uh, resistant training in the gym, also 45 minutes, 40-45 minutes, it depends. A long time ago I was really into fitness, but during my uh, studies of biomedical sciences, I placed everything behind because I wanted to focus and be the best or top of my class. So I kind of focused only on my studies and everything else was on standby. Now I have more time and I'm going back. Today is May 2nd and it's his birthday. Today he is exactly eight weeks old. Hmm? How old are you? Come on. <laughs> what? You hungry? You already ate, huh? All right, I'm back in the kitchen and I will start by coloring the eggs. I called first a friend of mine to ask him how to boil the eggs because I was not sure I haven't done this in a while. And apparently I have to place uh, this thing here on the bottom of the pan to prevent the water to boil too hard and crack the eggs. So, okay, let's make 13 eggs. Now I have to fill it with water. I used two liters of water. So this means that imagine if a cup is 250 milliliters. One liter contains four of these. So eight tablespoons of vinegar. Okay. Quick math. Okay, so far so good. No egg was broken. Now I'm going to place the pot. And let's hope that nothing will break. In the meantime, I'm going to prepare the dye. I have like six colors. And according to the tradition, the first two eggs must be red 
one should remain at home and the second one uh, should go to church. So let's prepare the work floor here because I hate messy working spaces. To my colleagues from the lab watching, you know what I mean. You know me. This is exactly 150 milliliters. I cannot do things more or less, it has to be just right. First in the red. Nice, everything is boiling here. And only eight minutes left until the game begins. The eggs are ready and now very careful. Nothing is broken. First egg, red. Let me put my gloves just in case I do something stupid. When you don't like a color, you can always mix or add oil. Look. See? Very nice. And then I will take the red one from here and put it in the green one. Now it's very important to take a little bit of oil to make them shiny. My favorites are actually these with the oil. are more flashy and mine are on the dark side because yeah because they were white ones yeah so that's the difference if you use white eggs you have nice flashy fluffy beautiful colors and otherwise you have this what so choose white <laughs> no faces <laughs> yeah i need a barber quickly so. <laughs> okay so basically you have to choose your fighter egg i'm gonna go with the green one because i don't know and you have to fight with this side. Yeah, yeah this does the side, let's see. Yours it's is It's mine, broken. yeah. Okay. So. Hey! So total disaster. It's yours. This one. So Joy, it's that's it. It. This one is the winner, <laughs> the big winner. <laughs> okay, I ain't eating eggs, though. 
Then. Really? Yes, I will eat eggs. Okay, okay my turn. Uh, yeah, your it's turn. your turn now. Your turn. Beautiful. It's okay, I film it. Where is mine? My <laughs> Hey, I broke yours. It's your turn, but only uh, yes. This is not nice. <laughs> it's not made to be nice. Hey, yeah, you're cheating. <laughs> yeah, I'm not cheating. It's yours? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah she yeah. win. I want to fight with Felipe as well. No, no. Fight. Yes, it's fight. <laughs> I'm, we have Choose another one. Because mine was broken. Felipe. Uh, Felipe it's broken yours? Give me your, give me the phone. I'm gonna oh. try one of yours. This oh. one is nice. The They're one. very beautiful. Wait. Okay. George, sorry. We will press like this. David? So now we have to cut morning, the coconut. <laughs> so this is the Bulgarian tradition. We do fights with eggs and we eat Easter bread or kuzunak. Voila! Thank you, David, for cooking it for me. <laughs> oh, this is David that made it? Yeah. Yes. This morning, he woke up early at 5 and he started he to... doing it. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing. <laughs> Are they still warm? Yes. Still warm and David made it this morning. Yeah, yeah not possible. He's uh, doing very well. So beautiful. Mm.